Hello Aries, welcome to your love reading. This is going to be for Aries, Sun, Moon, Venus and Rising. This is general so it may or may not resonate. If it doesn't resonate with you, feel free to check your other placement. Let's look at what's going on with you and the person you're thinking about first and then we'll look at your love life in general. So let's see, what's going on with Aries? The person they've been thinking about here. What are the energies? I'm hearing happy. So that's a good word. What is going on here? Queen of Cups, upright, page of Cups in reverse. The person that you're thinking about, they, ha they may not have apologized to you or they may not be reaching out. They may be focusing on their um, emotional health, but they may also have feelings for you, just not acting on those feelings. They could be Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or we'll have water in their chart, it could be Sagittarius. You, Aries, are running out of patience. Some of you may end up reaching out to this person or there may be a situation where someone else starts offering you love or you explore options. It could be that you go from not being into this person to being open to hearing from them. You may sense them coming towards you. So you're like, okay, fine. I will accept their apology. Let's see. Mutual energy. Five of cups in reverse. You are getting over the situation. Mm, but there's no communication there's no messages yet there could still be some bitter feel bitter feelings as well between you two or you towards them but there you're kind of getting over something that could be why you're kind of opening up to what could be an apology from them because you're getting over something like getting over what they did or something like that their next move This person may feel the need to rebuild something with you, not knowing why they want to do so with the two of swords or not, or trying to make up their mind as if, trying to make up their mind as to if they want to rebuild, but there's something about them wanting to rebuild or rekindle or repair the relationship with you. Ooh, in the near future, ooh. Could be a Pisces for some of you. This, some of you may suddenly end up in a relationship. I don't know if it's with this person. We're going to see with the rest of your spread. But what in the world? This and it's, it's, it's a mystery. Like with the moon. It may be some, it's something you don't expect. You ending up in a relationship quickly with someone. That you don't expect to end up in a relationship with. It could be this person. <laughs> it could be this person because the five of pentacles in reverse. Someone coming out the cold. You might, you may be taking this person up out the cold, but it may be a thing that you didn't expect to happen. Like you didn't, you had no idea. Hold on, let me pull some cards here because I don't know what's going on. What's going on with Aries and their love life? Please tell me. Oh my gosh. I knew it. This is why I pulled the freaking deck. This is why I had to shuffle these cards. I was just talking about you ended up in a relationship. I'm like, okay, if the relationship card comes out, then yeah. And here it is. I have tears in my eyes, okay. You might end up in a relationship with this person who you just kind of felt like okay i would accept their apology but you're actually some of you may end up doing more than accepting their apology you may end up with them i'm hearing for some of you you may run into some to this person at an event here's your favorite freaking card that loves to come out for you it's here again it skipped your last reading i was shocked when it didn't come out in the last reading it may be that they message you unexpectedly or that you run into them because I'm getting that um, intuitively that you run into them. Like I'm seeing an event that is outside with grass. It looks kind of like a fair. Could be a fair, 
but it's outside with grass. It's an outdoor event for some of you with grass. Grassy or it could be sand, it could be a beach, but I'm getting mostly like the image that I see is a grass type event outside, outdoors, where they have like tents set up, music, places where you can buy stuff and you know, stuff like that. But let's see. What's going on with Aries? Truth. They may come to you to reveal some kind of truth to you, maybe how they truly feel. We have signs and synchronicities. You may have been seeing signs um, leading up to this, or you may see signs, especially 222. What's going on here with Aries? Wendy Williams. Oh, I hate when this card comes out. Loki needs their ass beat. Talks about everyone, always in drama, insecure, shady as hell. It could be a female in your life. It doesn't have to be female, but it could be who, you know, does all of that. Let's see. Real love. I heard this song earlier because I was watching um, P. Diddy on Netflix. Butterflies, heartfelt connection, relationship goals. See, the word relationship again. Power couple, marriage, stability, wishes granted, romance, no question, no doubt. So if, if you've been wishing for a reconnection with this person, even if you were wishing for it in the past but stopped wishing for it, you probably will get that wish. It's like, be careful what you wish for because you just might get it. We have, I always feel like someone's watching me. Be careful of fake pages. They could have been watching you all along. All along. Um, and we have Anne Cutts. Someone putting on a show, peep the scene, watch your surroundings, drama king or queen, fake ass emotions. This definitely connects with this Wendy Williams and it could be a fake friend of yours or old friend. The emotions are fake. They just want, I'm hearing they want more info on you and what you're doing. You may know who this is. They want more info on you, what you're doing with your life and stuff like that. But uh, they're fake. We have new love. <sighs> Which throws everything off because what in the world? Maybe you'll meet more than one person. Some of you are going to be going out a lot. You'll probably meet new love and have this person also coming towards you. Could be Sagittarius, Pisces, Aries, Leo, Cancer, Scorpio. Let's look at your main spread. Why am I scared? <laughs> ah, here we go. What's going on with Aries? What's going on with Aries when it comes to love? Please tell me. What can Aries expect in their love life? I'm saying what can Aries expect in their love life and I was just drawn to the unexpected card so it's like <laughs> mm, let's see what's going on with Aries does Aries need to know okay Ace of Cups as your feelings. Mm. Who you got feelings for? Yeah, this person wants to come out of conflict, you see? This is someone you had a breakup with. This is someone from the past. Two of Cups in reverse as your mutual energy. Both, um, both of you are kind of thinking about the breakup at the moment like the elephant in the room it's up in the air you have the fool in reverse so you this is someone that you've decided that you're not gonna make a move on at all you're not opening you're not open to taking the leap with this person is what I'm seeing they definitely would have to come to you they have the six of wands they're really admiring you and um, they I mean they looks like they're watching you so they seem to be loving what they're seeing while watching you with that little fake page with no picture and some weird name to make it look like it's not them. And they could be Sagittarius. They're seeing you as temperance in reverse. They may feel like you have no patience for them. 
no tolerance they may feel like you could pop off on them at any moment or still be upset with them about something and you'll see them as a chariot you may feel like they're moving on or moving forward with their life it's kind of your perception here of them what's blocking is justice karma some of you some of you may you may have this could have ended for a reason things that needed to be healed balanced you guys were not in balance in the past when you said when you split that could be why two of pentacles is your outcome remember you got new love coming in so some of you may end up juggling this person and the new one at the time when you when you run into them maybe you've already met the new love when you run into this person or hear from them and so you got a decision to make why the five of swords in reverse Oh boy. They're disappointed. They may be running from someone to be with you. Just be careful that this person isn't on the rebound, but I see them running from something because they're disappointed and wanting to come out of conflict with you. And we speak, we was talking about fairs, and this is a fair. You can see the tent and the grass that I was telling you about. You could very well meet this person at a fair. Or be careful that you don't meet someone at a fair or event that is on the rebound or trying to get over someone. Just be careful. It doesn't have to be that case for you, but just a warning, something to look out for. Yet, um, six of cups in reverse. Someone who's stuck on the past with you. Why the six of wands? This person's been waiting, but they feel like you could be this queen of swords, guarding your heart. They could be guarding theirs too. But they were waiting. They've been waiting. Why temperance in reverse? Yeah. Two of Cups in reverse again. They feel like you're still upset about the breakup. They feel like you're still in your feelings about the breakup. That you're still feeling negatively or emotional about it. Most likely you're not because you're Aries. You get over things quite quickly. But <laughs> they think that you are. Maybe it's their ego telling them that. Why the Knight of Swords in reverse? The Knight of Swords in reverse again. Why does this happen? Just strengthening the message. Knight of Swords in reverse twice. Aries, what is going on with you? You are kind of rapidly getting over this person. So it could be that you just kind of look back and you probably think about the bad times with them and you're like, you know what, I need to get over this person because they're just, why was I even in love with them? Like, what did I even see? Some of you may be at that point where you just kind of like, almost completely over this person and this could be the annoying moment when they show up right when you get over them oh my gosh why the ace of cups strength some of you may meet a leo a new a new leo why the five of swords you may be over overpowering competition or you may win it could be that someone um, chooses somebody, chooses you over someone. Some of you are realizing that you're stronger than you think you are. You managed to heal your heart and really take back your power from someone. So it could be still you kind of taking back your power from this person, feeling like, okay, I'm over them. You know, they have no effect on me anymore. But the annoying thing is that could be right when you run into them and you're like, damn why are you here <laughs> why the chariots some of you may have seen them move on to a new relationship but like i said for some of you you're dealing with someone who may be running from some relationship that they're just not happy with not satisfied with because their emotions towards you is a six to one. So it's, it, this could be someone who moved on from you, but they're looking over at you like, wow, you are 
who I should be with. Like you're popping, your, your life could be popping right now and they're looking over and not happy where they're at. Why the two of pentacles as the outcome for Aries? <laughs> two of pentacles in reverse. Yeah, see? You're gonna be in a third party situation. Here's some drama for you. We got the hermit, it could be Virgo. You may withdraw because some drama may pop off involving that B-I-T-C-H over there, whether it's male or female. Whenever the Queen of Wands shows up in reverse, that is the same as this to me. It's like that same woman or man who is the drama starter, the drama queen, the fake emotions, the gossiper. So that woman or man who is gossiping may have something to do with you cutting someone off or not choosing someone in this love triangle some of you may end up in because you remember i said there's someone from the past here but there's also a new love you have and the one of them could involve some female or a friend of yours that could um be trying to affect this or affect your decision i don't know who this woman is i don't know if this woman is linked to one of your options or if it's your friend who is trying to or maybe you, for some of you it could be a friend who feels like you're getting too much attention or you have two options this friend may for example let's say you're talking to more than one person a friend might rat you out because she's jealous that you have two and she has none that's just how life is it's just how people are <laughs> what's going on in love for aries Healing family issues, yeah, you are realizing that you can heal all your trauma from the past and that you're strong. You're realizing you can do this and you do it and you take back your power. You may have heart-to-heart -heart conversations with that person from the past. You have trust. The situation is, uh, is calling for you to have faith. You have worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. Could be that you and this person, when you were together, it was imbalanced and it was the wrong time. What do we have for Aries? Twin flames, spiritual alignment, effortless, karmic. Hmm. Whoever you had that type of connection with, that is who this is talking about. Dating, whining, dining, romance. I feel like for some of you, this date may be to do with the new love. So they may see that you're dating and want to come forward. See? Triangle. Crowded relationship choices. You're going to have to make a choice. I'm seeing the love triangle come out in your outcome. You're definitely going to be letting one go though because the three of pentacles is in reverse. But for some reason, this horrible woman is involved in your love triangle. Either she's maybe a baby mother of one of your options or or is your friend but she or he gets involved without you know anyone inviting her in nobody sent for her we have dating queen opportunities dates abundance yeah that female could be jealous of you know how many dates you get she probably gets none you get it all i'm also getting for some of you if you're a man and you date females this could be an ex of yours or the mother of your kids from the past that you're not in a relationship with haven't been in a relationship with some ex of yours if you are a male who dates female or even female who dates female i don't know why i'm getting it mostly for men who date women that it's a female ex it's a female ex. Okay, but I really feel like it's a female. Maybe male for some small amount, but what is this person's hidden truth when it comes to Aries? The person that Aries is dealing with, what's their hidden truth? I lost myself for a little while. I wish things could be different and I'm becoming a better person. So yeah, this person could be, could have been the wrong time that you met them. They were not mature. The relationship wasn't balanced. They may have lost themselves while you guys were um, separated. 
yeah that could be why worth waiting for is here they needed time you guys met at the wrong time but like i said key points you may run into this person at a fair or some event or they'll text you out of the blue and you may meet someone new also what you don't see coming in the near future is some of you are dealing with a scorpio but we have death in reverse we have three of wands ace of pentacles in reverse you are hmm some of you may some of you are, are, are slowly but finding it hard to let go of past habits but you will but it's very slow some of you are resisting change you're definitely looking forward and you're going to be rejecting someone but that could be just you choosing someone when you have two options or more where you just reject and choose the one you want but you're definitely looking to to see who you want to end up with but yeah the main thing here is this person has feelings for you all over again but they worry that you're in your feelings and you may run into them at event at an event so they could be, i'm getting that they're watching you to see where you're going so if you're posting where you're going it could be that they show up on purpose because they know you're going to that event or they see you post there so they quickly jump in the car and go there but anyways <laughs> could be dealing with leo aries leo sagittarius um scorpio virgo yeah those are the main signs oh cancer as well so feel free to check your other placements aries if you want to know what else is going on thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one